With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, students. The question is: What will be the EMF for the given cell? So the given cell is platinum, H two gas, pressure P one, then H plus. H two gas at concentration at pressure P two and inert electrode platinum. So we are given here a cell and we have to find out the EMF for the given cell. So the cell is platinum H two gas P one H plus aqueous. so this is a cell representation and in this cell the left hand side this represents the anode this represents the anodic reaction and this is the cathodic reaction so if we write the e cell by using the nernst equation so it will be e cell is equals to e not cell minus rt by nf ln concentration of the products divided by the concentration of reactant or in this case partial pressure of the product divided by partial pressure of the reactant So E not cell minus R T by now n value. If we see here, the oxidation is taking place at anode. So at anode, if we write the reaction, so at anode it will be H two gas at pressure P one. It is forming two H plus plus two electrons. So this is the oxidation reaction, and at cathode. At cathode, these H plus ions plus two electrons, it is forming H two gas at partial pressure P two. So this one is the anodic, and this one is the cathodic reaction. Left hand side is anodic, and right hand side is cathodic reaction. Now, if we see the number of electrons that are involved in the oxidation or in the reduction reaction, they are two. It means n value will be two. The number of electrons that are involved in the reaction. So R T by N F N value N value will be two. So it will be R T by two F L N. Now the partial pressure of the product is P two divided by P one. Partial pressure of the reactant value. And we know that the E not cell is the standard electrode potential and E not for the H positive to H two. This is zero. Also E not is. This is also zero. That is, E not standard electrode potential for the hydrogen electrode is zero. So this will be zero. It means E cell will be minus R T by N F L N P two by P one. Or we can say when this minus, if we take this to its power, it will be. As minus one. Now, if it is the power of minus one, so we can write it as L N P one by P two, because it is the power minus one. So it will be L N P one by P two. So E cell will be R T by N F L N P one by P two. This is the E M F of the cell. So the correct answer to this question will be R T by two F L N P one by P two. So B answer is the correct option. I hope you understood the solution. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.